Hey guys, uh, Mr. Harris here. Uh, I'm going to make a couple videos for you guys um, and they're going to kind of go through how to do this next project um, in summer school. So you guys are going to have Tuesday, Wednesday and Thursday to finish this up. Um, so I'm going to go through it quickly and try to give you guys as much time as possible today to do the things that you need to get done. Um, so uh, this video here is just going to go through the, quickly the steps. Um, we're making a, I call it a Summer Schools Wisconsin home sign. Um, you're going to have a frame, uh, there's going to be a backing, and then you're going to have the State of Wisconsin outline, and you guys get to choose what you want to be lasered on that backing part or the back side of the, the picture, um, or if you want something on your Wisconsin home, or not home, but Wisconsin outline. Okay, big thing here is this design needs to be done today at the end of class. Um, because I will need to get them on the, the laser. Um, I'm going to try to get them all on. Mr. Singer is going to be able to help, and Mr. Carter, who's being awesome and, and feeling in this week while I have my training, um, is also going to try to get them on, but Mr. Carter's never really used these uh, machines before. So um, I need you to get them into me by the end of class, and I will try to get them lasered today for all of you guys. Okay. Um, so once you have your design done, um, in another video, I'm going to show you how I want you to um, download them and email them to me. You're just going to email them to my, my uh, school email, email account. Okay. So today in class, what you're going to do with Mr. Carter is you're going to be cutting the backing of your uh, sign. I have the wood already pre-cut to be seven inches in width. You're going to cut it again to be seven inches here. There's going to be some oops, wrong way. There's going to be some leftover scrap here. Um, if you don't, if you're not going to use that scrap, we're just going to put it on the table saw. If you are going to use it, like for a different um, uh, state shape, you need to let me know. Um, even if I'm in my training tomorrow, come ask me, and I will let you know if you can do that or not. Okay. So you're going to cut the backing. You're also going to cut the. As I'm going to grab it. You and whoever else might want to use this, the wood that you you choose. You're going to be cutting and planing this wood down. So you're going to plane this wood down to between three-fourths and half an inch. Remember, planers take your wood and they make it nice and level, and they also um, plane it down to a certain thickness. Okay, You're going to be cutting these into two seven-inch strips and two six-inch strips. Okay, Once you have these cut, you're going to want to put four pilot holes on each of the seven-inch strips, not the six-inch, just the two seven-inch strips. Okay, um, and then you're going to assemble your frame, the outside, just like we did with the washer boxes. Okay, once that's done, then we're going to work on um, our design, and you're going to need to decide how you're going to stain or spray paint the back, uh, the frame, and then we're going to leave. I would leave the uh, state outline just how it is, kind of gives it a little pop. So we're going to put polyurethane spray on all of it too, so that'll give it a nice shine. Okay. Um, so that's the, the project uh, in a nutshell. The next few videos are just going to show you Canva um, and that's and how to submit things. Okay, thanks. Bye.